Welcome back to Let's Play Guacamelee. I'm Burning Dog Face. And the quest isn't over until I say it is! It's Tuesday, and I haven't uploaded the final videos yet. Well, the bad ending videos. I just wanted to, uh... Get started on the uh, extra stuff. Oh, by the way, when I, was I realized what that is, and I was looking at the footage uh, last night. I believe that's Commander Video, the guy from the Bit Dot Trip games. Yeah, let's head to the desert. My money's on the bomb. Take that, projectiles! Where is that guy? He's in here! What? No. I guess it's the... Uh, there must have been a chest or something there. Alright, you... You short, ugly little troll! Let's blow this door open and find out what's behind it. What do you say, Luchador? Wanna buy my Dinamita is Spectral? And find out what lies through yon ancient gate? Here's five thousand dollary dues. Hope you enjoy your blood money. You son of a bitch. Weird. Honestly, I haven't tried magic. I haven't used magical explosives before. Maybe you did it wrong. Ah, oh, yeah, that would do it. Wouldn't expect any refunds from a guy you found lurking in a cave. <laughs> this one's all fucked up. Oh. Oh! What the hell is that? Then we have to go down and get the orb from the Technodrome. Ah! Let's not do that again. Oh shit! I'm blowing a hole down into hell! Just checking! What an oddly out of place tree. Molten cactuses are, sorry, cacti are strangely much more uh, in tune to this place. Jump cut! Okay, veering offline. What's the description of this one? Right. Just defeat Kalaka, right. Alrighty then. Oh. Well. Honestly, I wasn't expecting that. Hello? Whoa! A luchador? How did you get down here? Did someone check your papers? A huge hole in the wall, right. Uh, well, you can thank Kalaka for that. Well, you're in El Infierno now. El Diablo once kept this place running very smoothly. But since Kalaka's uprising, he's missing and it's pandemonium around here. Diablo used to run this place from atop that huge tower back there. 
I've never been above the third floor, but I heard he has a really sweet office. I like how calm and collected the damned are. This place is so disorderly since Kalaka teamed up with that sorceress and escaped. So what you will about El Diablo, but he kept things predictable. The torture kind of sucked, though. This isn't much. Oh, wow. So that's pretty good. That's pretty well uh, done. This isn't much fun. I find myself care on less and less. <laughs> DA, Devil's Advocates Law Firm. I like that. Anywhere but here. Uh, no. They say Kalaka raised his army from spare bones lying around, so the skeletons invading your world are puppets, not people. Even if he hadn't destroyed our bookkeeping systems, that would have thrown the census records completely out of whack. Did he give one thought to the hassle he was causing? Not very likely. Selfish, right? I'd been wondering about that, because, you know, most of the skeletons I'd uh, met in the world of the dead were very personable. The, uh... Monsters, not so much. It's crazy around here these days. I'm pretty sure I saw a rooster run by earlier. Maybe it's like someone's pet? How do you think I stay so lean? The ball and chain is actually a pretty good workout. I can't decide if that's a briefcase or if he's uh, supposed to be carrying another weight. Let us check something. Tostado. Oh, and they have the uh, Tostada versions of the other stuff, too. Alright, it doesn't look like any of these actually help with, uh, you know, pl platforming, as wonderful as that would be. Kalaka does not have the proper permits to be raising an undead army down here. If El Diablo were still here, he would be losing it. By the way, uh, I don't even remember where I heard it, but I've been since been informed that it's most likely that the sorceress's name is supposed to be pronounced Shitabe. So thanks to whoever told me that. Oh. Blasted button open this door! I have work to do! We meet again. Ah! Oh, Luchador, I was just examining this elevator. My elevator, which is broken, to my office, it is filled with very important documents. I just returned from my little hiatus in the world above, and I've noticed some tiny changes Kalaka has made around here. For example, he seems to have rigged these doors locks up to some sort of arbitrary achievement system involving all the old torture rooms upstairs. Oh, good! I don't know if he did this to train his soldiers, or as a sick joke, or what, but I can't do much about it in my current form. You know, it's funny to see you here, Luchador. Quite a coincidence, really. After I help you out of such a difficult predicament up in the desert, suddenly you arrive in El Invierno, all muscular and able-bodied. Seems almost like fate, right? Well, why don't you just head on up to the torture chambers and let me know how it goes? Yeah, I know I could run, but that feels better somehow. More satisfying. Challenge 1. Race to the goal as quickly as you can. Challenge 2. Defeat all of the enemies and get the highest combo. Challenge 3. 
Use the environment to defeat these invincible enemies. Challenge 4. Use carefully timed dodges to get through the thorns. A rooster came by and started clucking and flapping at me earlier. I had to physically shoo it away to get back to work. Fuck it, let's try this race out. Go! Hey, I made it with silver. Let's try it. Okay, twelve fucking seconds. Jesus. Okay, that was a mistake. Oh! All right, beat everybody. I can do that. Oh my God! Really? I don't know if I. Can, I don't actually know if I can do that because, like, I was just thinking, I'm probably never gonna get this achievement here. Combo nerd, achieve a 150 hit combo. And to get silver, I need 200. Christ. Lots of one hit. Nope. Nope. No. More. More. No power moves for me. to do it in as few hits as possible. And shame. Who would have thought I would do better at the race than at this? Damn it. It's really not necessary. Oh wait. That's the one that sends them flying. Right! To get the most distance. The restart button causes me to drop dead. Nope! Would you just go over there and die like a... Son of a bitch! Fuck off.
Damn it! Let go! So much for anything. Fuck off! Let's see if I can get a fucking bronze. Fuck's sake! Enough! Like, really? The switch? That's really necessary? Great, the idiot killed himself. Was this one again? Oh, good. <laughs> Oops. Move. Okay, that wasn't so bad. I thought it was going to be a lot longer than that. What's up here? Where'd the devil go? Challenge 5. Survive the waves of enemies as long as you can. If too many enemies file off on the bridge, it will collapse. Challenge 6. Defeat the enemies without dodging. Challenge 7. Jump between the moving platforms and get to the end as fast as possible. Challenge 8. Defeat the enemies without the use of your special moves. that again. <sighs> no. Ah, oh, god damn it. Alright, they totally saw my, uh, childish attempt to, uh, Use a uh, goat fly coming. Come on. No. Challenge eight. Oh, yeah, I already read that one. There are farm animals and luchadors wandering through my workplace. I have no idea who to complain to about this. <laughs> Challenge nine. Use your special moves to avoid the hazards and get to the finish. Challenge ten. Defeat the enemies without the use of throws. Challenge 11. Use your special moves to navigate the portal room. Challenge 12. Find a way to progress past the moving obstacles. Ah.
crazy go nuts! John 13, defeat these ultra powerful enemies. One hit and you're dead. Challenge 14, use the goat run and goat fly to get to the end of the course. That's the catch. Challenge 15, use punches, special moves, and throws to get the chicken to the exit. Dimension swap will help you control its path. Challenge 16, stay ahead of the deadly saws and climb to safety. Alright, I can't believe that's already been filled up. Ahem. It's a, uh, break room, I guess. Final challenge. Fight through a maze of arenas. Find the exit as quickly as possible. Well. I really, really, really have my work cut out for me. As far as I know, this is just one goddamn challenge! Or this is just one goddamn orb! Oh, good god. I'm burning dog face. And I'll see you next time. On Let's Play Guacamelee. Later!